for tuning in to TWEC Daily Devotion. And this morning, I'd like to speak to you on the topic, the joy of Christmas. As we enter the month of December and begin celebrating the season, let's remember Jesus Christ, the reason for the season. Let's remember the joy of his birth. Truly, he was a joy to the world in that his birth was no ordinary one. Since he came on this earth with a purpose, he died and rose again, and so is now our risen savior, our redeemer and friend. The great joy of Christmas comes through receiving God's gift of the savior, Christ the Lord. Even if you haven't received Christ as your savior, you may have some good feelings in this season. It is a wonderful time of the year. It's always good to be with family and friends, to enjoy good food and to exchange gifts. But I'm talking about something different, something deeper. The true joy of Christmas lasts all year long. It is the abiding joy of knowing for certain that things are right between us and God. It is a contentment that comes from knowing that we have a hope that is constant despite the uncertainties of this life. That kind of lasting joy comes only to those who have personally received God's gift of the Savior. Bible.org poses the question, why did the angel describe the news about the Savior as great joy? And they say, the news about the Savior brings great joy because it is good news for sinners and because it is news of Christ the Lord. Amen. Another point to note, the news about the Savior brings great joy because it is for all people. The book of Romans gives us this account. The angel said, that this news was not just for the shepherds, but for all the people. No doubt, these Jewish shepherds understood that to mean all the Jewish people. But there is also no doubt that Luke would have his readers know that the good news is for Jew and Gentile alike, for any and all who call upon the name of the Lord according to Romans 10 verses 11 to 13. It is a fact of history that the gospel applies to all and it transforms all who believe. Where it, go, wherever it goes, the gospel transforms sinful hearts as it is the power of God for salvation to everyone who believes. Romans 1 verse 16. So in closing, let us all embrace the true joy of Christmas. Embrace the Savior's love. Share about his love and joy that comes about by receiving the gift of the Savior and understanding that the Savior is available for all of us. John 1 12 tells us, but as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God, even to them that believe on his name. So enjoy the Christmas season. God bless you and have an awesome day.